With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is for a non-equilibrium process A plus B giving products, the rate of the first order with respect to sorry, the rate is first order with respect to A and second order with respect to B. If one mole each of A and B were introduced in one liter vessel and the initial rate was 1 into 10 power minus 2 mole per liter per second, calculate the rate when half of the reactants have been turned into products. Okay. Now um, the reaction is that A plus B is giving products right now the reaction is first order with respect to a it means that the rate law can be written as a which is the rate constant first order with respect to a and second order with respect to b so this is the rate law of the reaction right now if we have to find out the concentration of a that will be the number of moles of a which is one mole divided by the volume which is one so the concentration is one molar similarly the concentration of b will be one by one which is one molar you are given the initial rate of the reaction, right? So, initial rate is 10 to the power minus 2 is equal to the rate constant A. Concentration of A to the power 1. Concentration of B to the power 2. So, from here, we are going to find out the value of the rate constant, okay? Which is going to be 1 into 10 to the power minus 2. Now, what will be the unit? Now, this M means we are talking about mole per liter, right? This also means we are talking about mole per liter. And this reaction is the overall third order reaction, right? So, what will be the unit? Now, for the rate, if you talk about the rate, the unit is mole per liter per second, right? So, for this, the unit was mole per liter per second. For both the concentrations, the unit was mole per liter into mole per liter, right? This was square. That is why, again, 1 mole per liter, right? So, 1 mole per liter, 1 mole per liter got cancelled. How much is left with you? Mole minus 2 liter square second inverse. This will be the unit of the rate constant because this is for the third order reaction. Mole minus 2 liter square second inverse, right? So, this will be the rate constant of this reaction. Now, it says that if the... Uh, if the concentrate, if the half of the reactants were turned into products, right? If half of the reactants were turned into products, what does this mean? Initially, the concentration of A and B were one molar and one molar, right? Half of it is converted into products. It means that half of it is left. So, A left will be 1 by 2 and B left will be 1 by 2. So, the new rate R dash will be equal to A into the concentration of A. Now, we will write the concentration of A as 1 by 2, right? Because initially it was 1 and half of it is used. So, how much is left? Half, which is 1 by 2. And for B, it will be 1 by 2 only. Square, right? Because it is second order with respect to B. And we all, we have the value of rate constant also, which is 10 to the power minus 2 into 1 by 2 into 1 by 4. So, the new rate will be 1.25 into 10 to the power minus 3 mole per liter per second right so this will be the the rate of the reaction when the concentrations when half of the reactant has been converted to products right that's all for the question for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today